Hello, it's Karen here from UK Scrap Addicts and I can't believe it's August already. Uh, as you will see from the other ladies, we are working on a sketch this month um, designed by the lovely Laura Rumble. Uh, this was her original sketch and lots of ladies have used it this way. And I thought I would flip it round 90 degrees and have something at the bottom. And so from that, I designed a page, um, and as you see, I've got a smaller swag at the bottom, and instead of having these bits here, I decided that I would have flowers going across, and instead of the two photographs, I could have one large photograph and a piece of patterned paper. The paper that I'm using is actually from this block that I bought at the range and I think it was only about £4, it wasn't very expensive at all, but I'm really impressed with how thick the paper is, the quality of the paper. So if you're scrapping on a budget, the range is the place to go because it's got, let me have a look, 24 sheets in, in there, so 24 sheets for £4, a bit of a bargain. The other thing I picked up at the range was uh, these packs of flowers. So I'm going to use those to make my swag with the paper that I'm going to use. So the pink is one from that pack that I showed you. Then I'm going to put black on. And then I'm thinking that I'll have a strip of this as my pattern paper strip and I have um, a 5 by 7 photo of Grace Sear and Isla which I'm going to cut with just a small border. I've cut my, can you see I've cut my title out of watercolour paper so I'm going to paint that in the same colours as the flowers and that's going to be my first job. It's a lovely shimmery watercolour paints and I got them from Hobbycraft. Now that I've coloured my title in, I'm I need to start trimming my paper while I wait for it to dry. So I kept that piece 12 by 12, I cut that piece to 11 and a half by 11 and a half, and I cut that piece to 7 by 11. Now for the fun part, choosing where to put the flowers.
so I've just got the last few of my flowers to st stick down. Um, I've tried my coloured letters against the black and I don't actually like them. <clears throat> so I'm going to go and find some white letter stickers and use those. So there we are, my finished page with these pre-made flowers that I got from the range and I th can't remember how much they were. The paper, that was the £4 pack from the range. Some alphas that I'd already got and these gems, or well, these pearls which were also from the range and I think I think that pack was probably about a pound, I'm not quite sure. So, finished. So although it isn't exactly how I thought it would be, I actually prefer it. So if you'd like to see more of our interpretations of the sketch from this month which is this one then pop over to our facebook page or our blog or have a look on our youtube channel for ideas on how the other ladies have interpreted the sketch so thank you for looking and I'll see you again next month. Bye.